Raku Flacco, good to see you back. Where have you been these past three years? Long story. I'll explain later. What's been going on since I've been gone? Quite a bit. We've gone from the fifth age to the sixth age. Whoa. So what went down there? Well, combat evolved. The world geography changed a little bit. Yeah, I see that. Pretty big ugly pit out there in back of Lumbridge Castle. Then suddenly, it became a beach. And someone said that had something to do with Zamorak and Sarah Doman? Ah, yes, the gods returned, and Guthix is dead. Really? Oh, well. All he ever did was cry, slam down his fist, and go to sleep anyway. What did all the RuneScape video makers say about all this? Uh, well, nothing really. There aren't really any more around. What? What happened to them all? Well, when all the big changes started happening... Wait a minute! I remember something! Wasn't KK Comics doing a Project Justice series about three years ago, in which RuneScape vidmakers were being killed off by a mysterious assailant? First Gizzy Gaza, then Sky the Kid, then Bum Bum. There was a couple parts to it. Yes, he even made a part three, but it was blocked for copyright grounds. That's when he stopped RuneScape vidmaking. Aha! Sounds like a ruse. I bet whoever was behind the killings got them all. Uh, actually, it was more because... Sounds like we have a RuneScape cold case to solve. Quick, to the rat cave. There's a rat cave? No, 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 oops. Sorry about the rack hold answer there. Uh, that's okay, she'll respond somewhere, I'm sure. What I really wanted to show you was this. I've been saving these for a long time. Purple afros? I got them from KK Comics himself, during that last RuneScape gathering I was able to get to. I was hoping I'd never have to use them. But with the Purple Crusader gone, it's gonna have to be up to us. Put this on. Now, I am... The Purple and Green Crusader! So, who am I? You can be my sidekick, noob boy. Gee, thanks. I can't find anything on the evil-sounding Warner Chappelle guy who blocked the third part of Project Justice. The rat computer just can't locate any info on him. If I remember correctly from the Project Justice videos, there was a lot of cloak and dagger stuff going on. Now, who can we grill for information? Hmm. Wait, I know. There is one guy who's totally cloak and dagger. Let's go find a clue scroll. Five clue scrolls and two hours later. All right. I've twirled around three times wearing a pink tutu, whistling the Pink Panther theme, and shoving a banana up my nose. Now tell me what I want to know. Who killed the vid bankers? No one bites the wax poppy but the polar bear. So what did you learn? Never to talk to that guy again. He was an idiot three years ago and he's still an idiot now. Oh, now what? Well, there is one other guy who has his finger on the pulse of all that sneaky under-the-radar kind of stuff. Certification. Certification? Certification. Certification. You know that white knight guy who sits on the bench in Felidor Park? He's a top operative for a secret society of temple knights. He might be able to give us a clue. I thought you just did clues. And that's why you're new, boy. To Felidor! Noobs! Hey, hold up. <laughs> what? Um, well, you know, I, I, I noticed that uh, you have, like, a, a really cool cape. Uh, yeah, so? Well, I mean, I'm your sidekick. Uh, don't you think I should have a cool cape, too? Well, I guess so. Uh, well, the, would, would you happen to have one? Uh, hold on, I'll, uh, I'll get you one. There you go. Cool cape. Now let's get on to Sir Tiffy. So, Sir Tiffy, 
What can you tell us about the disappearance of the old school RuneScape vidmakers? Quite right, old Bane. There was definitely an outside influence, although even I'm not certain who it may have been what. We have some spot-on intelligence that indicates a perilous journey into a land beyond the wild may reveal the culprit. Beyond the wildy, huh? Sounds like we might need a cheesy montage of randomly cut together sequences to get there. Can you come with us? Ah, I would relish the adventure, what ho, but I seem to be a bit stuck here at the moment. However, I can provide you with this map I inexplicably seem to have a procession of, likely to speed along the plot. Stuck? Anything we could do to help? Jolly good of you at all, for my good man, but it would seem I was unaware that the paint on this bench was wet when I sat upon it. Although I certainly can remove myself with a little effort, it'd be a dreadful embarrassment to the Temple Knights to have one of their top men seen with paint stripes on the back of his armour. I'm merely going to wait for nightfall and slip quietly away under the cover of darkness. Nightfall in Falador? Okay, well, good luck with that. Thanks for the map. Let's begin that montage. Never gonna survive unless we get a little crazy. No, we're never gonna survive unless we are a little crazy. Crazy people walking through my head. One of them's got a gun to shoot the other one. They were friends at school Who is that singing? I think it's that guy over there Oh yeah, Seal Did you ask permission to use that song? Of course And they said yes? Well, I didn't say no I emailed two people at Perfect Songs LTD and they sort of ignored me. Oh, well, I hope they don't make you take the lid down. Hell, their name isn't Warner Chappelle, so I got a good chance. According to the map, we should be on the island of overused memes. You think we're in the right place? <laughs> Stay thirsty, my friends. Yeah, looks like it. That means there's a cave just south of here. <coughs> Pop-Tart? No thanks. This is the place? We'll find out in a minute. Hmm. Seems vacant. Over here, gentlemen. Uh, aren't you a Minecraft guy? The Minecraft guy, thank you. You're behind the murders? Yes, albeit not murders per se. You do realize as avatars that you can respawn. Yeah, I was wondering about that. So, I assume you're going to reveal your evil plan to us now. Of course. What fun is having a plan if nobody knows about it? You see, four years ago when my game was just getting off the ground, I realized how popular some of those RuneScape videos were. So, under cover of darkness, I sent brain-warping squids into Jagex headquarters. Once there, they attached to the heads of Jagex developers, causing them to make changes that the old school directors would find repellent. Such as Wheel of Fortune making the Dragon Helm look like a red Batman mask, EOC in Solomon's store? Yes, exactly. Come on down to Solomon's store, where if you aren't spending enough money, we're always happy to help you spend more. This week only, we have a special on evil squid masks. Only 40,000 room coins. Be the first in your clan to have your brain sucked. There's only a limited supply, so if you get here and they're gone, it will suck to be you. So come on down to Solomon's store today. Located just south of the Grand Exchange, or click on your upgrade and extras icon. 
After putting the changes in place, I hired a few player killers, caused a minor glitch that only I knew about, allowing me to lure the directors out using promises of better views and then killing them. Uh, once they realized they could be killed abnormally on the game and then finding out about the changes, they would be frustrated and look for another game to make videos about. My game. Sinister and brilliant. Well, let's see how that worked out for you. Uh, Gizzy Gazzle Minecraft, Bum Bum, Stop Making RS Vids, Seto Saucerer Minecraft, KK Minecraft, Dartron Minecraft, Sky the Kid, whoa, super popular in Minecraft, Max Poison, uh, whatever, uh, XL went to Minecraft and retired. Looks like you were successful for the most part. Aha! Looks like Tanoob Show just made another RuneScape God exposed, though. You didn't get to him. I sold Minecraft for $1.2 billion. Who cares? I should kill you, but like you said, they could have respawned, and personally, I like the changes. At least the ones I'm getting used to. So, I guess I won't. You'd just respawn in Minecraft anyway. So, why didn't you try and kill Racklefleckle? I only want to kill the popular video makers. On the other hand, I bet my dragon pick will make mincemeat out of your diamond pick. No need. I am through monologuing. The directors can make old school videos if they like the old game anyway. My work is done. Ta-ta! Well, at least that mystery is solved. You think you'll ever go over to Minecraft? Nah, I can't get into squares. The only emote they can do is jump. Well, let's head back. I gotta go shave my head. I think I got the afro with the lice in it again. Yeah, 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 yeah.